beautiful people welcome back to my channel it's your girl Shin Fash fab what's up wagwan what's good so anyhow tonight i am back with my vib haul that i did when sephora had their sale i think it was back in last month which would be april so i did pick up a few items that i wanted to share with you guys so i went ahead and i picked up the milk hydro grip primer this has been a rave much on instagram and on the uyt is it yt yeah youtube so i picked this up from sephora and this retail for 30 dollars and this is i don't know guys this is like a crack in a container crack in a container so this is supposed to hold your makeup in place applying it is a bit tricky when you read the instructions because you have to apply it on the back of your hand and then you apply it into your skin some people I've seen been rubbing it into the skin I normally just dab it into my pores and just making sure that each area that is settled in each area of my face and it is supposed to grip your primer not your primer it's supposed to grip your foundation so your foundation doesn't move throughout the day it stays in freaking place and I have to say that I definitely attest to this like this is like hands down the best freaking primer I personally have used milk if you're watching this definitely try to do one in a what's it called a matte or even a semi matte but this is and it has like this cooling sensation once it's applied to my skin holy dream this is just a holy dream in a container if you guys live somewhere where it's tropical and if it's warm or even where you're at now when it's going into spring or summer this is the perfect primer to hold your foundation in place like don't move it does not move what i did do i wore it for a complete day for probably it was like eight hours and then all I had to do was just block because my oils were seeping through but my makeup itself did not move did not I didn't even get to my lines that's how freaking good this is so this is a must on the list the next one that I picked up is my baby it's my baby it's the ABH dewy set mist spray and guys i freaking love this i have a review that will be going up on my channel i'm not sure if i will be uploading it before this one or after but i would definitely say go out and cut this i use it tonight actually and do you guys see how glowy i am i am glowing so this is a must and it's only 26 dollars so it's the regular standard pricing of setting sprays and it has this beautiful scent and don't be alarmed when I say scent because I have the most outrageous sensitive skin and this works for me. So if this works for me, trust me, it might work for any other girl who is sensitive on the skin. Definitely gives me that glowy look, especially now for the summer, which I'm glowing. And next on my list is that I picked up the Dior Forever Foundation and I picked this up in 7N. Now the tricky thing with Dior foundations, as you guys see I did purchase the Dior Backstage in 7N and that is hands down to today day one of my favorite foundations ever. So I said okay I'm gonna go ahead I'm gonna try this one which is the 24 hour high protection skin caring foundation with sunscreen. It's amazing but I don't find it to be as full coverage. I would say it's light to medium coverage and it's not matte. It claims it's matte but honey the same matte. And not only that, it's super freaking red. Like I was raving about it in my vlog but after I got home, retried the foundation like three times. Give it a try three times. And I looked at my pictures. I even looked at the vlog that I did. My undertone was coming off so freaking red. Like so red so this I will be returning when I return to the States again I'll be saying to return it back to Sephora so definitely a no for me but I did pick it up in the VIP sale the next item that I did pick up which I saw I love this one when I say I love that one yeah I love that one yeah I love it like oh my love curry chicken I'm love it all my love curry shrimp because I'm a seafood girl and I love chicken but it has to be organic chicken so I picked up the so far was it for Sally skin blurring primer 
yo this is the rejuvenation of freaking primers when i say skin blur this shit meant skin blur this is hands down feet down toes down perfectly perfect it blurs out my pores when i say it blurs out my pores i be looking photoshopped and snatched in most of my photography pictures i just love it i can't go into too much detail it's a bit pricey so picking it up when they had a vip sale was the best idea which i will be taking my time using this which i have the milk hydro grip so i can balance in between the two plus i have couple other primers that I can use but this I definitely will be picking up only when Sephora has sale because this is $54 okay but at least I'm a VIB Rouge and I got like 20% off so it wasn't that bad the next item that I picked up which is a skincare item now let me do the finish the makeup first then I do skincare I picked up the Fenty Beauty what's this the Sun Stalker bronzer in Mocha Mami love it love the rich undertone vibe i'm wearing it today it gives me that rich undertone vibe under my well for my makeup and this retails for 30 bucks and i did receive a 20 percent discount as well packaging is beautiful love it the next item that i picked up skincare now is hands down i definitely need to do a skincare video for you guys i need to share my skincare tips with you guys but i've been using the ole and rexon excuse me for the past two years i first got introduced to it by just using a sample and ever since then once i saw how it made my skin look i have been using this non freaking stop i use the serum i use the cream so the face soap i well the face well face the true gel cleanser i definitely go through this a bit more faster than i do with the face cream because i have other moisturizers that i use on my skin as well as the serum as well so i picked up like three more of these but I'm just showing you guys one. So this is a definite must-have in your skincare regime. If you suffer from adult acne, definitely. And last but not least, which I will rave. No, I have one more thing to show you guys. Is the Clinique Moisture Sur 72 Hour Moisturizer. Yo, let me say this good. This good. This is good. And I picked it up in the 30 mil, and this retails for $19. So the price point is not bad, but this is definitely amazing for all my sisters out there, our brothers out there that suffers from dry skin. Definitely get this. I am like a combination skin girl, but I still incorporate moisturizing in my skincare routine. So I love it. So I'm gonna show you the last but not least video um, item, and then that will be a wrap for this video. Okay guys, so last but not least is the Brazilian Bum Bum Cream. So I got this as a sample again guys. And even though I got it as a sample and I tried it, it was so freaking... Uh, it's $20 in a jar but it smells so good that I only use this if I'm going out. I rub a little on my shoulders, spread some across my chest because... The scent in this is just so heavenly I just can't get over how wonderful this smells so this is definitely hands down my favorite definitely so anyhow guys so that is a wrap for everything that I picked up in the Sephora VIB sale I hope that you guys did love this I have seen a couple videos of some of my subbies of the stuff that they picked up and girls I'm loving it I'm loving it so anyhow guys love you all and I will see you in the next video